other way, so his procedure has been done where we actually went in and um, drained your chalazion straight from the myelomin gland mm -hmm. and uh, made an atraumatic procedure. Um, how would you compare this? You had surgery on your chalazion not once but multiple times uh, previously with another surgeon. Yes. And uh, you've had this recalcitrant chalazion sitting there which is very irritating to you. Mm -hmm. What do you think about this procedure that so elegantly you went in and just drained the whole thing out and you went back to work and you're a nurse? Mm -hmm. So tell me from your medical point of view, what do you think about this? I think this uh, procedure is, was a lot less traumatic than the first one. Um, it was very good to could be able to go right back to work instead of being off work for a couple of days, having a very painful and swollen eye after the conventional surgery. With this, it was very too little, no pain after I went home and I was able to go to work right, you know, right after. Wonderful. How about your vision? Were you deprived of vision at all? No, not, not, no, what, no problems whatsoever. Uh, I was right back to my regular vision you know, right after the numbing and everything went away after the procedure. Sure. So. Right. Now remember, in some cases it may still need surgical intervention, mm -hmm. but uh, given the elegance of this procedure, I'm proposing this to be the step one. Mm -hmm. of how to approach it and if you get it done that's great and you're free. Uh, would you agree with that concept and would you relate, tell me how your previous surgeon when he did the surgery? Yes. How did it go? Uh, I do agree with this procedure being the future especially in, in, the, in case, cases like mine. On my first surgery the, when they went in there and took most of the chelation out the, the surgeon told me um, he couldn't get all of it because it was so close to a blood vessel. He was risking, you know, maybe uh, nicking that vessel, so he was afraid to keep going further. So I ended up with have, still having this tie in my eye. With this, you know, you're able to go straight into the glass and open it up, so it actually takes care of the problem. It just doesn't leave the problem half solved. So it's yes. a lot, a lot better. I, I, I agree. And um, you know, it's it's fast. It's not as painful. So it, I, I do see it as a, for me at least, it was a way better option than my first. Uh, regular surgery. Also, we took the opportunity to clean up the glands around exactly. it so they don't become so it's a chalazion. Like preventive again. surgery, that's right. right. Today I'm seeing you, I mean, your images, you can't tell there was a chalazion, and also mm -hmm. your glands are nice and flowing very well. Yeah. Well, I'm a, a critical care nurse, and uh, I do, really I think this is a lot less invasive as the other one. Way more to, uh, people that have low uh, toler pain tolerance, you know, this is a way better approach for them than you know having little um, injections in dry and having your eyes being so sore for so long. This is a lot better for them. And just like I said, you know, it, I think it goes straight to the issue rather than having uh, parts of it still left, you know. So it's uh, I think it's a very good approach and you know results show that it's, it's pretty much gone. Mm -hmm. Basically here you can see as the whole thing has started to come out mm -hmm. right here. And then all I did is just press a little and the whole thing drained out of that perfect oh, I opening see. from there. I and that's why I picked this part uh, just to show you. Okay. So, wonderful. Okay. Do well. Congratulations. Thank you. It's a pleasure. Absolutely.